Sorry guys, I sound a little bit sick. That's because I have a sore throat. But anyways, I wasn't joking when I said Rich Dad Poor Dad was my first book. Um, here are my other books so far after that one. These two I'm not gonna count because this one was from school graduation and this is just something I had lying around but I don't really use it. It's not for business or any, any of that sort. But here are my actual books in which my first book is 48 Laws of Power. Just read Law 11 so far so I'm now on to um, Law 12. Uh, guys, I really don't read books that much but uh, when I get to, I'll read probably a law and then go to sleep. My next book is Think and Grow Rich. Now, I haven't read this whatsoever, so uh, not much to get in on here. And here's my most recent book, Sell Like Crazy by Sabri Subi. He's a founder of the marketing agency King Kong, which is one of the most um, fastest growing agencies in Australia. I went on a website to get this. It, I paid like six dollars for it so no, that's great anyways i haven't read too much into this um i got it for about six dollars online so that was great but i've only read up to here so far i've just read the introduction now and i've just stopped here which is think like a billionaire good book so far but i hopefully it will actually get me clients that's what i'm looking for anyways let's move on to the video As you guys can see, I've gotten a haircut, but anyways, that's not the focus of this video. Today, I just wanted to recap on my months of August and September now that it's October. I'll share with you some knowledge at the end, so be sure to stick to the end of the video. So just quickly, my previous thoughts on holidays, if I haven't mentioned it already in my other videos, is that they don't last. Um, if you know anything about time, time can move fast and slow. There's not really a middle ground. Um, you know, when you're enjoying something, time goes fast. When you're not enjoying something and you're pushing yourself through something, it feels slow. As well as that, I think if you have holidays, you should be dedicating towards something meaningful, um, whether it's a skill, a side hustle, or just learning things. I don't want you to sit on your ass, um, watch movies all day, play video games all day, or scroll all day on TikTok and save and like things that you'll probably never follow up on. That is an absolute time waster and that's shit you've already been doing um, after school. So why would you want to do that at a time where you've got a full 24 hours consecutively to, you know, dedicate towards something? For me, that's, that's how I would do it. If this is what your life sounds like, I'm gonna be honest, you gotta do something different because that is how a lot of adults spend their time. They work, you know, they clock into their job and by the time it gets to the weekend, they don't actually advance in their life and instead they constantly rely on a paycheck to make up their income. And I promise you that is a trap, especially now that you do not wanna be in. Just a little heads up. So anyways, I've changed my banners on YouTube and Rumble. Um, and if you guys haven't been on my Rumble, please go to that and follow that as well. That would be great. Anyways, just discussing a new book that I just showed in the intro, which is Sell Like Crazy by Sabri Subi. Um, I found out about this book from The Truth Hub, which is a guy I watch. Um, shout out to him for this book. I watched the video about the single mother work ethic if you can put it on the screen and he linked it to this book so i searched it up i found out that i bookmarked the offer long ago so i basically went on the site um they did a little offer where the book was entirely free and all i had to do was pay for the shipping so ultimately that cost me about seven dollars which is just insane um i probably bookmarked it ages ago I've shamefully got over like 8,000 bookmarks that I've yet to clear. Yeah, it's really like a debt. So guys, with this video, I'm just going to talk about very briefly um, my plans I should have done in September, which is probably going to lead into November. 
and this plan very broadly is going to be an education slash informative month recap of my august and september progress i'm thinking about doing a three to four video part series because the information is just getting ridiculously long and it would cause me to rush through it and just export one big block as well um, which i understand is very unappealing I've become very aware of how long my videos should be. I get genuinely worried when my fans get loud when exporting, so look for me to upload this video part series in November. It will be 10-15 minutes per video that will provide you with easily actionable information. So get ready because I'm looking forward to this. Discussing uploads, since the school break is over and now school is back, I'm gonna have to go back to uploading one times a week. I know, what a bummer. Um, but just understand, personal branding is not my top priority. Learning and honing my skills in the real world is. I promise you I'll be documenting this on my channel, but once I start picking up my finance, that will carry over to my channel with more quality content. I'm so eager to share my progress with you guys. This repetitive act of just talking to the camera, having some images, no edits, and you just see my face behind my mic. I know that's boring. I understand that once I learn more about video editing, I'll be able to diversify my content. When I complete my driving, which is at the end of the year, get a good income and expand my content, especially in regards to good video software like Premiere Pro or DaVinci Resolve, my channel is definitely only going to go up from there. I understand how hard it can be with the competition on YouTube, but I will remain dedicated to stick with this, that it will be important in the future. I don't want to let my knowledge and life go to waste and being able to put myself out there means I have a chance to make it big, make something of myself, really get in there in the entrepreneurship space and network with role models. I'm sure that by putting my thoughts out there, I share to you a part of my life that no one else directs but me. This is a path I've chosen for myself and not achieving by my word for the people around me would be absolutely dishonorable. I wouldn't know how to live with myself without providing value as a man. See you all later. Look forward to getting out my next few videos.